how to use aloe vera there are plenty of ways you can use aloe vera both topically and internally number one heal burns due to its soothing moisturizing and cooling properties aloe vera is often used to treat burns a 2013 study with 50 participants found that people who use aloe vera gel to treat superficial and partial thickness burns showed but the research that the group that used up 1% silver sulfate diacin cream. Number two, improves digestive health. Consuming aloe vera may benefit your digestive tract and help to soothe and cure stomach ailments, including irritable bowel syndrome. Three, promotes oral health. Aloe vera toothpaste and mouthwash are natural options for improving oral hygiene and reducing flux. Number four, clears acne. Using fresh aloe on your face may help clear up acne. You can also purchase aloe products designed for acne including cleansers, toners, and creams. This may have the extra benefit of containing other effective ingredients too. Acne products made with aloe may be less irritating to the skin than traditional acne treatments. Five, relieves anal fissures. If you have anal fissures, applying an aloe vera cream to affected areas several times throughout the day may help promote healing. A 2014 study found that using a cream containing aloe vera juice powder was effective in treating chronic anal fissures. Is aloe vera safe? It's safe for most people to use aloe vera topically for minor skin care concerns. Generally, it dwells. Tolerated skin irritation and allergic reaction are possible. Never use aloe vera or any severe cuts or burns. Pay attention to how your body reacts to aloe. Notice if you experience any sensitives or adverse reaction, don't use aloe vera. If you are allergic to garlic, onions, or tulips, avoid taking aloe vera within two weeks of any scheduled surgery. Women who are pregnant or breastfeeding and children under the age of 12 should avoid the oral use of aloe vera. Carefully follow the dosage information when taking aloe vera gen or latex internally. Limit your use to small periods of time after a few weeks of use. Take a break for at least one week. Always buy from a reputable brand to ensure safety and quality. Do not take aloe vera internally if you have the following conditions. Hemorrhoids, kidney condition, renal disorder, cardiac condition, ulcerative colitis, intestinal obstruction, diabetes. Possible side effects of aloe vera include kidney issues, blood in the urine, low potassium, muscle weakness, diarrhea, stomach pain. Talk to your doctor before using aloe vera if you are also taking the following medication because aloe vera may interact with them. Water pills, herbs and supplements, digoxin, warfarin, stimulant, laxatives, diabetic medication. Aloe vera gel is widely known to relieve sunburn and help heal wounds. But did you know that your favorite potted plant can be used for much more than sunburn relief and household decor? The succulent has a long story of being used for medicinal purposes. Dating back to ancient Greek, the plant is native to North America. From relieving heartburn to potentially slowing the spread of breast cancer, Researchers are just beginning to unlock the benefits of this universal plot. If you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell for more updates. Thank you.